St. Louis, Missouri. Michael Cole, here with Taz at ringside. I'll tell you, Cole, these WWE fans are so fired up, I'm having a hard time staying in my seat. I'm with you on that part. We've got a great show here tonight for these St. Louis fans, and I can't wait to get started. Great reversal! You know, there's no doubt that The Undertaker is one of the most impressive superstars ever to set foot in a WWE ring. But you know what? You're only as good as your last match. How can you say that, Taz? The dead man has proven himself time and time again. I highly doubt that that would change if he lost this match, which I don't think... I don't think the fans like that one too much. I'm sure this breaks this guy's heart. It should. These fans are the lifeblood of WWE, and he doesn't give a damn what they think. I don't think anyone in this match has even considered that they might not walk out the winner. I'm sure they have it, Cole. That's the kind of attitude that gets you beat quicker than anything. As soon as you let the slightest doubt into your mind, you can forget about it. And that's something I don't think people realize. The mental conditioning of the WWE superstars is just as impressive as the physical conditioning. He slipped out of that one. One of these superstars successfully executes their finishing move. This one is over. That ain't necessarily the case, Cole. Just because it's called a finisher doesn't mean it always ends the match. You sound like you're speaking from experience here, Taz. Of course not. Whenever I locked in the Taz mission, that was it. End the story. It was over. I think you're developing a selective memory in your old age, partner. Trouble call, I am telling you. His opponent really softened him up. And now one good submission move can end this match. Nice quick counter. Oh, look at that. He's pleading like a stuffed pig. I can't tell if that's a cut or a broken nose, but either way, the referee might need to stop this fight. The ref's not going to stop the match, Cole. It's just a little blood. Come on. Be a man, will you? Nice reversal. If I had to pick only one reason why I'm not on Raw, it would have to be Kane. Just being this close to this monster is terrifying. I couldn't imagine having to do it every week. Look at this. He's lifting his opponent by the throat. He's got this guy way up there, Cole. What goes up must come down. You know, you can show off for the crowd all you want, but all that does is let your opponent rest up. Actually, Taz, I think it's a great display of confidence on the part of this great superstar. I know we got his brother, The Undertaker, on SmackDown, but how great would it be if King was a SmackDown superstar? How cool would that be? I don't think that's a very good idea at all, Taz. As a matter of fact, it's kind of terrifying. You see, Cole, that's the reason why you would make a horrendous general manager. Someone talks about bringing one of the top superstars in the business to your brand, and you refuse because you think he's too scary? before we saw that. I don't like it, but as long as it wins matches, it's going to keep happening. That, uh-oh, I don't like where this is going. And neither does his opponent. Choke slam from hell! You know, Cole, I'd ask you who you were pulled for in this match, but I think it's pretty obvious since the beginning who you're rooting for. I never claim to be completely objective, Taz. It's no secret I respect superstars who stick within the rules and show some sportsmanship in the ring. You gotta understand, Cole. I know it ain't exactly kosher, but you're putting your body on the line in there. 
You gotta do whatever it takes to protect you. You feel like a real jerk when somebody counters you like that. If you ever wondered just how much punishment a human body could take, I think you're gonna get an answer tonight. You might be right, Taz. It doesn't look like these superstars are going to go easy on each other. That's not what they're getting paid for, Cole. And besides, they got too much pride to give less than 100% in there. He was one step ahead on that one. So, Cole, you got any predictions? Uh, you know, who you think's gonna win this one? No way. I've seen you at Barrett. You gotta do whatever it takes to get the hell out of that casket, pronto! These superstars are on fire tonight! They sure are, and I don't think they're going to be put out anytime soon! That was a textbook reversal! Jeez, what a match. I got no idea what these superstars are gonna do next. That makes two of us. Uh-oh. Goozle! Oh my god! What a choke slam! All the way from hell! A textbook reversal! Can you follow up? Hey, the ref's got a tough job. I mean, trying to keep these superstars on the up and up, that's hard. He saw that one coming. I think they're slowing their pace down a little bit, Cole. And that's a good way to refocus your energy, but you'll also give your opponent time to recover. That's not good. It certainly isn't. But if you try to rush things, you could wind up making it. Wow! Great reverse. It's been said before, but that doesn't make it any less true. Kane is pure evil to the core. This monster doesn't care about anyone or anything. And you say that like it's a bad thing. No, but there's more to being a WWE superstar than brutalizing your opponents. I don't think Kane knows that. He dodged that bullet. Look at this, Cole. Look at this. Oh, my God. There's a reason that's called a finishing move. The match usually doesn't go much longer. there's ever been a more dominant superstar in WWE than the legendary dead man, The Undertaker. Yeah, but you can only stay on top of the mountain for so long. And the dead man's been there for a very, very long time. That might be true, Taz, but I don't see anyone on the horizon who could dethrone the Phenom. There's the reversal, Cole. It's not easy maintaining this type of intensity week after week after week, Cole. Trust me. I don't doubt it, Taz. The WWE superstars don't get an offseason. They compete every week until they're not physically capable of continuing. When you see this level of competition, Cole, there is no doubt that SmackDown's just head and shoulders better than Raw. I couldn't agree more, Taz. Raw has some incredible superstars, no question about it. But they just can't compete with SmackDown's finest. Come on, Cole. I know you're just trying to be diplomatic, but you can't seriously sit there and say that there's anyone on the Raw roster you'd want to have here on SmackDown. No, I'm 100% serious, Taz. Can you imagine having Triple H or Batista or Chris Jericho on Friday nights? That could take SmackDown to the... Uh-oh! He's got his opponent in the casket. I don't even want to think of what... That was an impressive win, Cole. I got a new respect for him. Well, he wasn't planning on...
on winding up in that casket tonight. But that's exactly what happened. Here's your winner. I don't even consider the fact that you might wind hey. up buried alive. Still choke down that ramp for the match. You can't. Plain and simple. You don't go with the match like this one thinking you might lose. But there you go.